A-head form has just shaken up the robotics world in a way nobody saw coming. In only three months, the company secured two major funding rounds. And the reason is simple. Their humanoid robots aren't designed just to move, think, or work. They're designed to feel. This isn't another industrial robot hauling boxes or testing balance in a sterile lab. This is about creating a machine that can look you in the eye, express emotion, respond with empathy, and even recognize itself in real time. That's not just a technical breakthrough. That's an emotional one. The company was founded by Columbia University PhD Hu Yu Hang, and its vision challenges the way we think about humanoids. While Tesla, Figure AI, and Boston Dynamics compete on efficiency and power, A Headform is betting on something far more human connection. Their belief is simple humanoid robots will only succeed in society if they can form genuine bonds with people, not just complete tasks. At the heart of this strategy are three bold pillars. The first is mirror self-perception. Most humanoids today rely on pre-programmed actions. But EMO, the company's flagship robot, can observe its own movements, refine them, and build a dynamic sense of identity. Not human consciousness, but a model of itself as an entity. The second is an emotional foundation model. Unlike language models, such as GPT or Gemini, this one is trained specifically on emotion. It doesn't just hear words. It reads tone, facial cues, and micro-expressions. Then it generates authentic, adaptive responses. Imagine a robot that doesn't just hear you say, I'm frustrated, but picks up on the strain in your voice, the tension in your face, and then reacts with genuine empathy. And the third pillar is a bionic face, where most humanoids fall into the uncanny valley. Yemo's expressions are startlingly natural. A smile, a frown, a raised eyebrow. They feel alive, building trust in ways no mechanical mask ever could. Together, these three elements, self-perception, emotional intelligence, and lifelike expressiveness, form what Ahead Form calls humanoid empathy value, a new metric they believe will one day matter as much as battery life or computing power. That vision is shaping EMO's real-world applications. Instead of replacing humans in factories, it's built for environments that demand emotional engagement, retail, healthcare, and entertainment. Picture a robot that greets customers with warmth, comforts a patient with empathy, or responds to a child's laughter with joy that feels real. And this is only the beginning. A Headform's second project, Elf Schwan, pushes the boundary even further. Inspired by virtual characters and digital storytelling, it brings lifelike, emotionally intelligent personas into physical form. Imagine a theme park where characters aren't people in costumes, but embodied, emotionally responsive robots. Investors are backing this vision because history shows one thing. Emotional connection drives adoption. Sony's Ibois, a head form, is taking that idea to the next level fusing advanced AI with robotics designed for trust, relatability, and presence. But this also raises profound questions. If robots can model themselves, read emotions, and express empathy, are we witnessing the first steps toward robotic self-awareness? Not human consciousness, but something close enough to make us rethink our relationship with machines. A head form is betting big that the future of humanoids won't be defined by strength, speed, or efficiency. It will be defined by empathy. A future where robots don't just coexist with us. They connect with us. So what do you think? Are emotional humanoids the missing piece for mainstream adoption? Or are we heading into dangerous territory by teaching machines how to feel? Share your thoughts in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe for more breakthroughs from the world of robotics and AI.